Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today, we are taking a closer look here at the brand new Splatoon 3 Amiibo that just launched today, November 11th, which is also Veterans Day, so happy Veterans Day, everyone. Um, I just wanted to show you guys a closer look at these things. In America, unfortunately, they do not sell these three Amiibo in a three pack, so you have to buy them individually here in America. Other countries do have three packs, though. I bought mine at Target. Um, very limited stock at a bunch of stores, so I recommend shopping either online or going in store and seeing if your store has them. Whether it's Best Buy, Target, or GameStop, those are the best places to shop for these. Um, I'm not going to unbox them because I like to keep my Amiibo sealed. I just started collecting Amiibo this year, so I'm, what I'm going to do at the end of this video is show you all my Amiibo that I have as well to go along with these. But these are the newest ones in my collection. This is my first time ever getting Amiibo on their launch day, so this is pretty cool. Let's take a look at all three of these. This is the Splatoon 3 Inkling Yellow. That's what it's called. It looks very good. I love the tri-stringer bow that they have with it. You guys can comment in the comment section below what is your favorite Amiibo from the Splatoon 3 wave here. In the future, I'm going to guess that they're going to be doing a deep cut Amiibo series as well with... Shiver Fry and Big Man, so stay tuned for those Amiibo. I'm pretty sure they're going to do those. I love how this one looks. I'll probably share with you guys what's my favorite as well. Today is also the start of a Splatfest. Team Grass versus Team Fire versus Team Water. I just want to give you guys closer looks, and then I'll show you what you get in the game as well. So we'll, we'll probably scan this in the game and one thing that's nice is you can scan these amiibo through the box now nintendo allows you to do that because they respect the collectors <laughs> um here's what it looks like on the back it shows you how to use the amiibo it says get special in-game gear i'm surprised it doesn't advertise okay no it does it shows a little outfit on there we'll see what we get but this is the inkling yellow amiibo inkling girl now we'll move on to the octoling boy which is blue I love the box art for these Amiibo. I think that it looks great. These look really cool. Um, I'll probably put some images on the screen as well, what these look like out of the box. I'll just find some on Google because as much as I really want to open these, and maybe I will in the future, I think keeping them sealed makes them even cooler for collecting. I think this one may be, may be my favorite because blue is my favorite color. It's between these two for sure. This one looks really nice. And then, last but not least, oh, I'll have to show you guys what it looks like on the back. Okay, this is my favorite one, I'd say, because the gear that you get is really cool as well. You get, like, ninja... Or no, this is like a sushi gear or something. I don't know what it is. We'll see what gear we get when we scan it in-game. Last but not least, the Small Fry Salmonid Amiibo, a.k.a. Little Buddy. It's great that they made him into an Amiibo. And funny thing is, this is exactly, I think, I don't know if this is how my Little Buddy looks in the game. But he's in the story mode as well as Salmon Run. So that's really cool that they made him into an Amiibo. This one looks really nice because of the nice ink wave that they have there, as well as the Salmon um, Run Golden Eggs on here. He looks great. Very detailed. Nintendo gets better and better when they release Amiibos, I'd say. On the back. Okay, this guy has some really cool gear. It's like some night gear for your Inkling or Octoling in-game, so that'll be cool to try out. So there's all the Splatoon 3 Amiibo. They're very cool. They're out now. They're $15.99 a piece here in the United States. I'm now gonna show you guys my whole Amiibo collection, which does not, I won't include my Amiibo cards because I have so many of those and those are Animal Crossing. I just started collecting Amiibo this year, but there's King DDD. Here's some more Splatoon ones, Callie and Marie. I'm trying to get all the Splatoon ones eventually. Um, I just got these earlier this week, two days ago, because these are officially restocked back in stores such as Target, so you can get Pearl and Marina and Callie and Marie now. Just got these ones the other day. These ones are really nice and detailed. 
Just thought I'd show you guys these. I have Kirby. As you guys can see, I have them all sealed. I have Meta Knight. And then I got this one from Best Buy, um, I think last month. Or no, two months ago in September. When Splatoon 3 came out, I bought this. That's the Inkling Boy Amiibo from Splatoon 2. So my Amiibo collection continues to grow, guys. Here's all my Amiibo so far in terms of Amiibo figures. Like I said, I have tons and tons of Amiibo cards from Animal Crossing. I'll just show you guys a few of them here. You can see videos on these on my channel. But yeah, I love collecting these Amiibo figures. I'll uh, be buying more in the future as well. I think I want to get those Metroid Dread Amiibos. Even though I'm not a fan of the game, I think they just look great. But yeah, there's my Amiibo collection. It's continuing to grow with the new additions of these three back here from Splatoon 3. We're now going to scan these in-game and try them out. See what they give us. Quick shout out to all of you guys who are friends with me here on Nintendo Switch. There's my friend code. I just leaked it. <laughs> I have so many of you guys on here. I'm getting close to full capacity, but shout out to all of you here on my Switch. There's a little shout out for you guys who are friended with me. So if you see yourself here in this video, comment below that you saw yourself. Look how many, it just never ends. There we go. Um, so we're going to go ahead and go and open up Splatoon 3 and try out the Amiibo. All right, everyone, we're going to be scanning these three Splatoon 3 Amiibo here in the game. I have my Splatoon 3 OLED Nintendo Switch. Let's go ahead and scan these Amiibo in the game. Like I was saying earlier, I think the next Amiibo wave will be these three guys here, Deep Cut. It is Splatfest day, like I said, so the city has a sunset. And later tonight, in a few hours, I'll be streaming the Splatfest. As you can see, there's decorations up, getting ready for the big event. I'm excited for it. I love Splatfests. This is where you're going to go if you want to scan in a Splatoon Amiibo. I'm Team Water, by the way, for the Splatfest. But you want to go to this big Amiibo box here. As you can see, it's decorated as the Splatoon 3 um, Amiibo box looks like. Kind of looks similar to this one here. So, we're going to go ahead, click A for Amiibo. And it says, tap Amiibo to NFC Touchpoint. So you kind of just have to kind of guess where the NFC sensor is, the NFC chip. So I'm going to lay my switch flat. And it says you need to register an owner and give your Amiibo a nickname before you can use it. So we're going to go ahead and do that. It takes you to your switch home screen to do that, and it clicks on your me and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and register these, and I'll be right back. Okay, everyone, I registered this one. So you can easily scan it. Another day in Splatsville. Can you feel it? The energy, the life. Look, it just says yellow on there because that's what I had to call it. Because you can only have up to 10 word, uh, letters in your name that you call your amiibo, so that's kind of unfortunate, but I just called it yellow because that's what it says on here. But yeah, it's really nice that you don't even have to open these anymore, guys. Nintendo used to put a little blocker chip there to prevent you from scanning these through the box, but now they let you do it, so that's great. You can use these while keeping them in the box. So that's, that's fantastic. Hold up, do I know you? Check that. I want to no, you. Hi. Look at you. We've got a fresh one here. Nice. I'm digging it. Although I'm not digging it quite as much as I could be, what I'm saying is something's missing. Alright, guys. So what they do with Amiibo here, I've already had a little bit of experience using these Amiibo uh, in a game. Not these specific ones, but other Splatoon ones. You have to play battles, and once you win 10 battles they give you all of their gear. So all the rewards that you get for these amiibo, you get for playing battles. So that's what happens with that. You'll probably see my gear that I get in a stream sometime. But yeah, I just want to show you what all these look like in the game. One thing you can do is register fresh fits, freshest fits to the amiibo, and that allows you to easily equip your favorite fits in Splatoon. 
Okay, let's go ahead and use this amiibo. Of course, I have to register it in my console. So, the way you do that is go to System Settings, go all the way down to Amiibo, and then register owner and nickname. I'll call it Octoling. There we go. There we go. Splatsville is nuts, it ain't it? I love it here. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Welcome. Anyway, hey, what's shaking? So what do you say, friends? I say yes. Let's make it official. All right, so as you guys can see, they give you, for becoming friends with this amiibo, they give you the starter uh, pack, I guess, the, the first item. And you can go show off your style in multiplayer battle. And once you win, I think 10 battles it is, you get all of their gear gifted from them. So it's really cool. So they kind of watch you play battles. And then these of you will become your friends. So it's very cool. He gave me that little gift. And you can save gear to Amiibo or you can take photos with the Amiibo. Let's go ahead and do that. This is what it, this shows you how to do it. We'll do that. I need to go ahead and get the item, the first free item from this Amiibo here. Alright, in honor of making it official, this present's for you. <laughs> Naughty boys, that's what they're calling it. Alright. So, the first gift that they always give you is uh, something for your feet. So, some type of shoe. Let's go ahead and do our last amiibo here. The Alright, thank you. Let's go ahead and um, you do the last amiibo here. The small fry, little buddy. <laughs> Once again, you have to register it to your Switch. So let me go ahead and do that. All right, guys, here's little buddy. Um, this amiibo, when you scan it in, it looks like this. It doesn't look like the one that's in the box. So that's kind of interesting. They don't have the ink wave or the the power eggs there, the golden eggs. So that's qu quite interesting. But there he is, nonetheless, surrounded by the sights of Splatsville. This little small fry must not know where to look first. Uh, it seems to have noticed you, and now it's staring at you intently. Don't be alarmed yet. So this is actually quite interesting. This small fry doesn't talk to you. It has the, the game talks to you instead for the small fry. We're gonna be friends with him. So make sure you choose to be friends with them so they can give you gear and watch your battles. All right. Look, a present just for you. This is what he's given me, Chaos Kicks. Very cool. Um, I think the small fry amiibo here is the one that gives you the night gear. Yep, so that's gonna be really cool to get. Stay tuned for my Splatoon 3 live streams. That's when I'll be showcasing all the gear that I get from these. I'll probably go ahead and do some battles today before the Splatfest. And during the Splatfest, I'll earn the gear from these amiibo. So thank you all for watching. I recommend buying these amiibo if you're a Splatoon 3 fan and you feel like amiibo because they give you great um, in-game rewards. Even if you only want to buy one a specific one, these are great gifts for the holidays as well. There's the Splatoon 3 Amiibo. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.